Hello. Good evening. Hello. Hi, teacher. Hey, hi. Good, and you? Aquí ya, queriendo terminar la semana. <laughs> like trying to finish the week? <laughs> that is awesome. That's really cool. Sí. Yeah, and how was your day? Bueno, yo hoy estoy tranquilo porque me tocó salir en la etapa. Ah, ¿really? Una visitando ahí la competencia y las tiendas. Ah, hey, that, that, that's great. That's really cool. Hey, look at, look at Eric's picture. <laughs> Now it looks different. <laughs> All right. That, that looks pretty funny. Nah, but it means that you had a hard evening. day. Right? Hey, good evening. We were talking about your picture. You look different. Ah. Uh, you change it. Because, uh, uh, what? Ah, <laughs> uh, no, you changed what? The, you changed the picture because you had it one uh. different. Oh, okay. The one that you had before was different than the one you have now. <laughs> it's, it's in the office of um, um, uh, uh, how is it? Ah, it's a little bit. Bueno, in the hapa. In the hapa. In the hapa? No, I can't. In the hapa. Ahí nah. está. Ahí está Salvatore. Ah, ok, cool. That's really cool. And uh, how was your day, Eric? So, so. So, so. so. Really? Sí. Yeah. Something yeah. interesting in the, uh, in, the, in the workplace? Or just like, like normal as always? Um, it's, it's a normal day. Uh, cool. Hoy no me quejo. <laughs> you don't, oh, yeah. you don't, you, yeah, you, you don't have any complaints today. Hoy es el sueño normal. No, sí ando, sí, porque es que ando, ando con sueño, porque ayer, este, bien, bien tarde nos sacó el profesor de, de las clases de inglés. Ah, really? Yeah, me too. Sí, ah, sí, sí. I, 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 I was <laughs> I, we were <laughs> sleepy because of yesterday's class. It was too late. <laughs> no, actually, I wasn't sleepy today. The thing is that uh, I finish I finish work uh, from Monday to Friday. I finish working at at one at one. I finish working. Yeah, because now my my schedule has changed. It's not the same as one week ago so now i have a different uh, schedule you know like having classes is like sometimes it's different it's not permanent the same schedule so now i have more time like free time in the afternoon so i have uh, a time between 1 p.m until 4 because at 4 p.m my wife finished working So I have to wait for my wife to finish work and pick her up from her work and come here, right, to the house. But we have a house near the place where she lives. I mean, we have a house in Nusulutan. But the thing is that we don't have internet in that house. That's why we do not stay there, okay? So we have to come here. <laughs> So, but when, when I finish classes, I, I go to the house and try to sleep. But now I couldn't go. I could not go to sleep there. So I, that's why I'm like, ah, like kind of a sleepy, kind of tired, you know? It's like, ah. I, I, I wanted to sleep. But the thing is that there, there was one teacher that got sick and he could not go to class in the afternoon. So I have to go 
and cover his class. And I was like, uh, okay. Anyways. Con tanto piso ya hubiera puesto internet también en Osulotango. Remember, I have, I, I'm, I'm getting ready to bring them my first son to this world. So I need, yes, I, I, I need to be ready. So that's why, I mean, and I'm paying like a certain amount of money for the internet here. And if I put it there, it will be double, double payment. Yeah, it's like mm, not that good beneficial. Yeah, because we stay there only on weekends, Saturday and Sunday. Yeah, I mean, it's like not. Hay not que really ponerle fun. un buen paquete de datos al, al teléfono y compartirlo. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Like, like, yeah, it's like, like, like that. But you know what? The place where the, the house is located there, the internet doesn't work that much. The phone internet doesn't work that much. It's very slow. <laughs> yeah, not, not because I have I have a lot of internet in my phone because I have a plan that is like, like how can I say this? It does not expire the gigabytes. They are like accumulating, accumulating, accumulating. And I got like 48 gigabytes of internet only this month. Yeah, and it like, yeah. One to 40, 40, 48. Yeah, it's like 48. Yeah, a lot of it. <laughs> no, but it's it's just like a fifteen dollars plan. I mean, it's not that much. Teacher, I have I have one plan similar than you. Really? Yeah. Uh -huh. My giga my gigabyte is accumulator. Ah, accumulator. right now. Uh -huh. Right now, I, I think uh, I have around. Uh, 24, 25 gigabytes of internet. Ah, it's, that's it's, cool. it's accumulated. Yeah. Uh -huh, it's accumulating every month. The thing is that the plan is only 15 gigabytes every month. But since I use Wi Fi in the house and I don't use the mobile data, that's why they are accumulating every single month. So that's why it's like kind of high. Yeah, but that's cool, Ever. That's cool. Yeah, I mean, we got internet to give up. Teacher, you need, uh -huh. you, you need to have a one modem in the Lambrick. Yeah, I, I'm thinking of buying one. Yes, I do you really need, need one. You need a uh, one modem in the Lambrick. Yeah, yeah, actually, yeah, that, that's true. I'm thinking of buying one uh, probably uh, this, this coming month. Yeah, it's very beneficial. One of those. One of those things. Yeah. Okay. All right, people. It's 8.09, I think we're going to start because uh, I was waiting for the other ones to connect, but let's just start up with the class. Remember that today we finished week number three, okay? And, and I'm going to say this in Spanish. Listen, todavía hay ciertos, ciertas personitas por ahí que me deben tarea y algunas que me deben todas las tareas. And please, please. Yo. <laughs> yo dice Jonathan. <laughs> hey, Jonathan, please. Pasando me... lista. <laughs> hey, Jonathan, eh, me las completa esta noche, por favor, porque sí, voy a necesitar su nota. Please, please, please. Okay? Just like the five homework. Yeah. All right, all right. And uh, Hilmar, are you there? Vamos a pasar la navaja a Hilmar. Nah, Hilmar is not there. Ah, yeah, he's there. Hilmar, you just, in, got, yeah. you just got 40%, man. You need to increase to 100%. 60% is missing from you, okay? No, I don't understand. <laughs> ah, no, no, no. But, but eh, me faltan algunas suyas. Algunas sí, como todos nada más me faltan las 14 y las 15. Nah, perfecto, entonces, perfecto. All right. Sí, es el... Muy bien, sí. Ah, perfecto, sí, porque eh, eh, no, es, no es a modo de presionarlos, pero sí, necesito, <ríe> es que necesito esas, esas notas, ah, como dicen, para ayer. <ríe> es que como ayer terminábamos eh, la, la semana, y you no, know, eh, básicamente ahora sí, sí o sí, tengo que subir sus notas, all right, to, to the okay. system. 
Okay. okay. Perfect. Thank you, Helmer. Okay. Right. Okay. Let's let's pass the attendance list and let's start with uh, with the things that we got for today. Give me a second. Oh my God, jueves 26. Yeah, we got Ana Claribel. Hmm, no here, right? Okay, we got Ana Maria. No. Y Ana Gabriela. Present. Okay, thank you, Miss. We got there. Eric Guillermo. Present teacher. Okay, very good. Ever de Jesus. Present. Okay. Uh, Fatima Alejandra. Nah, Fatima is not here yet. Floridalia is not here. Gilmar Cruz. Present. Okay, perfect. Jonathan Alexander. Present. Nah, okay, good. Carla Benacir. Present teacher. Nah, okay, perfect. Uh, Natalie Vanessa is not here. Nubia Zulema. Present teacher. Okay. Romeo Alexis is not here. Rosa del Carmen, no here. Roxana Yesenia. Ah, yeah, Rosa is there. Come on, Rosa. I, I just see the, 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 <laughs> the roof. <laughs> I ¿Cómo don't... que no estoy? Eh? ¿Cómo que no estoy? Solo veo el techo de su casa, Rosa. Ah, now I see you. Ah, you see. Good, Rosa. Ya tiene la asistencia, Rosa. Uh, Roxana Yesenia. Nah, she hasn't showed up, right? Salvador Alfonso. Present chair. Ok, good. Sara Carolina. No, here we go. Stephanie Lisette is not here. William Alberto. Present. Okay, perfect, mister. Let's see. Joanny Noemi. Mary Joanne is not here yet. And the last one is Stephanie Janet, which is not here. Okay. In a second, I'm going to start the presentation that we got for tonight. Tonight, what we're going to have is just a, a general feedback from all the topics that we have been discussing. And also, we have the homework that you left from yesterday. Okay. Remember that we didn't finish. So just let me confirm if you can see my presentation. All right. Do you see my presentation? Yes. Okay, yes. perfect. So this is the video conference 15. And uh, today's topic is just going to be vocabulary practice. That's the topic for tonight. All right, what are we going to do in this video conference? We are going to be practicing the main structures that we have been discussing during the week. Okay. So that's pretty much what we're gonna have for tonight. So let's start with that. Okay, let's start with the class agenda as always. The first thing that we're gonna have like for tonight is review from the previous topics. And let's start from yesterday's topic. What was yesterday's topic? Can somebody tell me what were we discussing yesterday? Etiquette. Now, nah, okay. All right, good. Etiquette at the workplace. That was uh, the topic, right? And well, what is, what is, what do we understand by good etiquette? Can somebody tell me? What were we discussing about good etiquette? What is that? Los saludos. Now, nah, okay. Hello, please. Excuse me. Now, okay. Uh huh. That will be one. one uh, uh, that will be part of a good etiquette, right? Uh huh. Jonathan. Yo lo veo. Yo lo veo como personalidad. Like a personality. Now, okay. Now somehow it's like a personality in which you can apply 
part of that personality to every aspect of your life. It can be in your house, in your workplace, with your friends, okay? And even with the with the with your surroundings, like your wife, in your, your mother, school. Father. I'm sorry, Jonathan. What do you say? In school. Not in even in school. Very good. Even in here. Even in here in this class, you can have a good yes. etiquette. What will be one of those good etiquettes that you got for this class? Can you can you mention one of them? Uh, Hey, eh, good night. Thank yeah. you. Okay, all right. That's one of them. Jonathan? Excuse me. Ah, the punctuality. Ah, the punctuality. Very good. Jonathan, well, what do you say? All, all content. Nah, uh -huh, uh -huh. Besides that one, what else? What else can we have as a good etiquette for this class? On the camera. <laughs> okay, turn on the camera. <laughs> hey, Jonathan, eso fue así, mire. Fue, fue de, mi, de, de pantalla en pantalla. <laughs> hasta, hasta se me quebró. <laughs> sin dedicatoria, sin dedicatoria. Ajá, ajá. Put attention in the class. Pay attention in the class. Okay. No, nah, very good. That's one of them, right, Rosa? Nah, Ras is there, yeah. She's paying attention. Right, Rosa? Don't sleep in the class. Nah, you see. Yes. Nah, but Ras is paying attention. <laughs> Bien cómoda esta Rosa. <laughs> okay, good. Yeah, I mean, that, that is part of a good etiquette in the class. Another one, to work in pairs. For example, when, when I tell you to work, okay, one by one, or work in pairs in the breakout rooms, that is part of a good etiquette, right? To have a pair work, okay? To have a pair work, that is part, is part of a good etiquette, okay? It's like, like kind of similar to, to, as I told you, to the good manners that we got for everything in our lives, okay? Having that brief introduction about good etiquette, Let's perform the homework that you had from yesterday. Okay? Good. Eric, who did you work with yesterday? I, got, I work with Diana. Ah, with Diana. Is Diana? Ah, yeah, Diana is here. Diana, are you there? <laughs> yeah. Yes. Yeah, she's there. <laughs> okay. All right. What was that structure that you created for your people visiting other companies. Can you tell me? There were six, six of them, right? Eric, read three of them, and Diana, read the other three. Uh, no problem, read the one that is already done. Include the one that is there. Okay, esa no la apunté. <laughs> <laughs> No problem. Check, check the manual. Check the manual. Sorry. Permit. Ok. Um, empiezo yo, Eric. Ok, por favor, gracias. Ok, entonces la primera es Put your cell phone on vibration. Vibration. Ok. Y luego está to be on time. No, ok, be punctual, to be on time, good. Eh, quiero ver, we wear formal dress. Wear formal dress, ok, good. Ok, good. Eric, are, are you going to help Diana? Ok, uh, greet everyone in the facilities. No, okay. And use polite language uh, and respect opinions. And respect opinions. Very good. Those are like the six, right? Yes. Okay. Very good. Thank you, Diana. Thank you, Eric. You did it excellent. Now, You're Ever, welcome. 
If I'm not wrong, ever you were working with William, right? Yeah, right. William worked with me last night. Yeah. Okay, perfect. Let's read three and three. Three and three. Yes. Okay, perfect. William or me? Uh, let's start up with William. William, can you please read three of those good etiquettes that you were uh, doing with Ever yesterday, please? Okay. Uh, the use of money. Um, William, I, I, I barely understand you. I don't know if you got problems with the audio. No, it's for the rain. No. Ah, okay, okay. Uh, can you please read the, 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 the second one that you mentioned? Podría leer la segunda, William, por favor? It's because I, I didn't listen that much. The use of appro appropriate vocabulary. Appropriate vocabulary. Ah, okay. Appropriate okay. vocabulary. Okay, perfect. Be proactive. Ah, be proactive. Okay, good. That that too. Like, be very active, right? Proactive. Good. Use polite habits. Nah. Okay. Very good. Ever continue. <laughs> okay. Uh, greet everyone in the facilities. Mm -hmm. and knowledge of the subject of aliens to do mm -hmm. and the last one be diligent be diligent or diligent or diligent i don't know yeah, how diligent. to say ah, okay okay like a diligent okay all right perfect thank you ever and thank you william you did a great. Thank you. Uh, Nubia, who are you working with? I work to uh, Hilmar. With Hilmar. Ah, Hilmar. Please. Okay. L read the first three, you, Nubia, and then the, the other three is going to be read by uh, Hilmar. Okay. Greet everyone in the facility. Mm -hmm. Dress appropriately for the office. Use polite language. Number okay. No interrupt the other speaker. Don't interrupt all the speakers. Okay. Say goodbye when retiring. When leaving. Because retiring, in ese caso, la palabra retiring significa uh, retirar o pensionar o jubilar. Okay. 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 Entonces es mejor like leaving. Okay. I'm gonna write it's it down in right. the chat. Mm -hmm. Like this. Yeah, because retiring is como cuando ya llamamos de salida. <laughs> okay. Para la bodega, yeah. Yeah, like 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 Eric. Falta mucho, Eric. <laughs> I'm, I'm playing with you, Eric. <laughs> okay. All right. Thank you, Hilmar, and thank you, Nubia. You did it excellent. Uh, let's see who's next. Salvador, who do you work with? If I'm not wrong, you were working con, with Stephanie, right? Con Stephanie. Ah, there you go. Now I still remember. <laughs> okay, <laughs> good. Okay. Salvador, read the first three, and then... Uh, Mrs. Janet, read the all three. Um, Counting to obligation. Uh -huh. Continue. Um, support. Uh, no sé si conociste a los compañeros partners. Uh, a los compañeros. In, that case, uh, in that case, it will be co worker. Um, Eh, 
Uh, didn't you finish yesterday, Salvador? Co-worker. Co yeah, it's like compañero de trabajo. Okay. Ajá, Salvador. Okay. How many did you read? ¿Leyó las tres, Salvador? Eh, dos tenía aquí nomás. Me demás lo había notado. Diferente, pero no lo encuentro. <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay. All right. Yeah, he's honest. Okay, uh, Mrs. Janet, help him, please. The drugs. Okay. <laughs> okay. Ay, Salvador. Es que le entra un virus a la computadora. That's why, right? Right, Salvador? Okay. Uh, sí, lo hizo el teacher el mes pasado. No, okay. Yeah. Thanks okay. God I have a new computer now. I, I mean, another computer now. <laughs> Ajá, Mrs. Janet, continue. Okay, este, always keep the facilities clean. Facilities clean. Mm -hmm. um, to be on time. Ah, okay, very good. And, and dress formally. Nah, dress formally. Nah, okay, good. Okay. Thank you, Mrs. Janet, and thank you, Salvador. That of dress formally is like uh, awkward to me. Like for example, in my in my other job, I had to wear long sleeve uh, shirts, long sleeve shirts with tied here with with tied, and I'm like ah, uh, yes, I'm not really used to with tied. Just imagine in Usulutan, like with that hot, and you in wearing a long sleeve shirt. And tie, that's, nah, it's a, Eric, ma, ma, Eric know how we feel. Eric sabe el, el, cómo se siente aquel calorcito rico. <laughs> and wearing a tie, yeah, not a good idea. Incómodo con el calor y solo el hecho de, de andar así, ¿verdad? Exactly. It's very, very uh, uncomfortable sometimes. Okay. Good, let's continue. Natalie. Hi, Natalie. Hi, teacher. Who were you working uh, yesterday with, Natalie? Eh, con Rosa. Ah, Rosa. So, yeah, Rosa sí. there. Good. Natalie, read the first three, and then Rosa is going to read the other three. Okay. Eh, la primera sería, be punctual to the meeting. No, okay. Mm -hmm. Control the character if you do not agree on something. Mm -hmm. Okay, good one. Put the cell phone on vibrador. No sé cómo se dice, teacher. All right, put the cell phone on vibration. Vibration to avoid discomfort. No, okay, okay, very good. Rosa, continue. Uy, de pronto la cámara de Lidia se hizo toda tétrica. Así la like. Like a phantom. <laughs> <laughs> hey, Rosa. I'm waiting for you, Rosa. Yo creo que el audio es ahí Rosa, uh, uh, we don't listen to you, Rosa. I think you have problems with the audio. Respect the facility. Ah, okay, very good. And take care of the furniture that the company provides. Nah, okay, good. Those are the ones, Rosa? All right, I think I... I you did uh, just you just did only five, right, Natalie? 
You just did only Hola? five. You just did only five. No, seis hicimos. Ah, because I didn't listen, Rosa. I just read, uh, Rosa just read two of them. Eh, le voy a decir la otra que hizo ella. Ajá. Treat a company employees with respect. Ah, okay. Treat the company's employees with respect. Okay, very good. Yeah, the thing is that, that Rosa, I think Rosa has problem with the audio. Lo que pasa es que estoy viendo aquí está súper fuerte y casi no le escucho. Ah, that's why, that's why. Con razón. Hey, that's cool. That's really cool. Acá no, gran calor está. Yeah. But anyways. Ya llovió suficiente. <laughs> ok, Rosa, thank you. And thank you, Natalie. Hmm. Fátima, who were you working with yesterday? María. Con Ana María. With Ana María. And Ana María is here? Yes. Eggs. What time did you come here, Ana María? Qué calladita. Teacher, hoy voy a... Es que necesito estar acostada. Este, no voy a encender la cámara. Es que tengo muy inflamado el pie. No se me, no, no, no se no me. Se no. no. Pero nada no. para el cine. <ríe> Como ¿Qué? en el meme. Ah, Como en el no, meme. mire, aquí ando. Lo que pasa es que estaba acostada. Por eso tenía apagada la, okay. la cámara. Ok, Ana María. Pero, pero sí me duele do mucho el do pie. You, no do you still, si... really? Do you, do you still have problems with the, with the, the foot? I'm sorry. Sí, bien frito. Yeah, I mean, that's weird. Es raro. Mm -hmm. uh -huh. But do you, have med do you have medicine? Sí, pero solo diclofenac. Y no, no tomo otra cosa siempre por la gastritis. Ah, yeah, I mean, you got gastritis, mm -hmm. right? That's a big problem. Mm -hmm. Yes. Sí. Okay. Uy, ya va a llover aquí. Mm -hmm. Good, good. Mm -hmm. <laughs> no me acaba de enseñar Natalie. <laughs> No, Natalie. Sí. I'm kidding. Sí, se, <laughs> se, se siente el viento fuerte. <laughs> sí, qué malo. <laughs> ¿Qué dice? <laughs> que me voy a quedar sin señal, dice. No, de tu vida. <laughs> no, lo que pasa es como la vez. ¿Verdad pasada. que está haciendo viento, Natalie? Sí, as, no, se está bien rojo el cielo. Sí. Ajá. Sí. Pues, Así que ni modo. Si ¿Arrepien? me desconecto, ni modo. Ok, good. Like, arrepiéntase de sus pecados. <laughs> ok, good. Fátima, let's start reading the first three and then Ana María. Ok. Greet everyone in the facilities. Mm -hmm. Second is be punctual at the start of work. Mm -hmm. And three, be responsible with their work. Mm -hmm. Ok, very good. Ana María. Yeah. Uh, the uh, old people talking and louding. Nah, okay. Uh, uh -huh. I got you. <laughs> okay. Pero solo hicimos cinco. Why just five? Sí. Teníamos la primera. Uh, no, problem, no, no sé si all people arrive all punctuality punctuality mm. no sé si lo dijo Fátima all right ajá uh -huh, yeah yeah I mean like, make it shorter be punctual that's mm -hmm. it mm -hmm. yeah actually ajá uh -huh, she said it solo eso ya no había hecho más mm. oh my god <laughs> <laughs> es que oye, no. yo, yo tengo otra teacher, pero okay. es que se la hice a papá. Ajá, claro. have, have a good presentation. <laughs> uh -huh. Ok. Y be respect with coworkers. No, ok, very good. Ajá. Uh -huh. Be respectful with coworkers. Ok. That's another one that is really important, right? In, in, in the workplace. Ok. Thank you, Fatima. Thank you, Ana María. Uh, let's see who's next. Who's missing? Hmm. Sara, who are you working, Sara? Hi, teacher. Hi. I creo que no está todavía. Who? 
No me recuerdo el nombre. Oh my God. Pero no. Well, well, let's see. Who's missing? Uh, is missing. Uh, na, 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 na. Okay. We got Jonathan. We got Romeo. We got. No, Rosa is already participating. Who's, who's the one that you were participating with? Is, it, it was a boy or a girl, Sara? Girl. A girl? Pero no está, no ha ingresado. Ah, you mean eh, Roxana? Roxana? Creo que sí. I, I think it was Roxana because Joanny didn't, didn't show up yesterday. So, but, but read what you have, Sara. Read it, please. Mm, ah, pues dentro de las que habíamos hecho, um, eh, you said the uniform respectively. No, okay. ¿Sale el uniforme the, respectivo? Use the mm -hmm. uh -huh, respective uniform. Um, uh, no, the sample, the one key word. No, okay, work. good. Uh, también, John is working or. No comer en horas laborales. Don't eat during, okay, during uh, working. work time. During work time. That would be. Work time, okay. Yeah, like. Entonces, like la cambio. Uh, don't eat um, during work uh -huh. time. Like this. Yeah. Um, you sell the. Appropriate, appropriate vocabulary. 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 Okay. Just that? Okay, Sarah. Thank you. Uh, who's Thank next? You. Who's missing? Who's missing? Hmm. Jonathan. I think Jonathan has not participated. Who were you working with, Jonathan? Uh, Romeo. Ah, Romeo. Hey, Romeo, are you there? Good Yes, okay, Romeo. Aunque no lo veo, pero ya, yeah, let's do it. Okay, Jonathan, read the first three and then <laughs> Romeo, no problem, Romeo, you're eating. Enjoy it. You know what? You know what is enjoy it, right? Enjoy it like this. Enjoy it. Enjoy it is a good way to say provecho in English. Right? Enjoy it. It's like, buen provecho. Okay, Jonathan, read the first three. <clears throat> uh, good presentation. Important finish the good business with other, other, other bosses. Uh, work and initiative, initiative work. Uh -huh. uh, communica communication. Communication, uh-huh. Uh, Personal rela, 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 relationship. Relation, relationship with every people. Now, okay, very good. Romeo, let's continue. Uh, two, two, uh, five. Mm -hmm. uh, import, import, cleaner, good, this thing. Word interactive, good presentation, uh, be communicative, communicative, uh -huh. uh, creo, eh? Sería, no. how personal relationship is why every people. Okay, but personal relationship would be like a good personal relationship. Yeah, because only personal relationship is like como relación personal. Uh -huh. It can be understood as different ways, but I got you. I got your point, Romeo. Okay, good. Thank you, and thank you, Jonathan. Uh, Carla, did you participate already? All right. Teacher. Okay, who were you practicing with? Uh, with Roxana. Ah, you were with Roxana, so then it was no Sara. Huh. Okay, good. Uh, read yours because since Roxana is not here. Yeah, be punctual. Be punctual, uh-huh. Uh, formal office. Mm-hmm. Uh, 
uh, the not answer the phone in the meeting. Mm -hmm. okay, okay, yeah. Say goodbye cordially and formally the ever young. Okay. Uh, represent the company where they go. Mm -hmm. Okay, very good. All right, thank you, Carla. You did it excellent. I hope Roxana to connect later on. All right, uh, Nubia, did you participate already? Yeah, all right. It's teacher for Hilma. Ah, yeah, with Hilma, that's right. Okay, uh, I think Carla was the last one. Okay, let's continue with the with the things that we got uh, for tonight. Let's let's move on with this. Uh, right after that, okay, the introduction to the homework from the previous topic that we were practicing, we're gonna have today review the structure cool you. We're gonna make a review from that structure. Okay, we're gonna review would you mind, and I hope you remember that structure too, because we we discussed that structure last last week. If I'm not wrong, we were doing that um on thursday like seven days ago at the beginning of week number three and we're gonna have a review from should and should not okay and at the end we're gonna have a, some activities okay as part of the work in the manual right yeah eso de las actividades es un par de eh, eh, de, de, de ejercicios que vamos a hacer en el manual all right, so this is pretty much what we have for tonight. Okay, so let's go on. Let's move on. Could you and would you mind? Do you remember Teacher, when? Yes. Podría regresarla solo para copiar lo último. Okay. There you go. Let me know when you finish. Yeah, teacher, gracias. Okay. Did the rest finished? Yes? Okay. Good. Let's continue. Could you and would you mind? Do we remember these structures? Okay. When do we use could you and would you mind? Can somebody tell me? When do we use them? For to say... A polite request. Now, okay, very good. To say or to ask polite requests. All right. Very good. We use could you for and would you mind? I have, for example, could you open the door? Ah, very good, Jonathan. And what is the way of answer to that question? What would be the answer? Sure. Yes, of course. Very good, Jonathan. Yes. Remember, in this type of a structure, we do not say or we do not answer with yes, I could or yes, I would. ¿Por qué no? Ah, sencillamente porque si respondemos de esa manera, estaríamos dando una, una manera positiva de respuesta. But, listen up. Pero, con la diferencia de que ahí no estamos dando seguridad de que vamos a hacer lo que se nos solicita, lo que se nos pide. ¿Ok? Si yo me encuentro a Nubia y Nubia va ocupada with a, with, with a lot of things in her hands and, and she, she asks me and she requests, hey, could you open that door for me? And, and I say, yes, I could. Ah, sí podría. But in that case, I'm not saying that I'm going to open the door. Solo le estoy diciendo, sí podría. Mas no le estoy asegurando que lo haré. Okay? That's why we don't mention yes, I could or no, I couldn't. Okay? Sino que ya contestamos con very short and precise answer. Like, yes, in a moment, in a minute, right away. Okay? Right now. Those are the words in which we can use. Okay? And we can paste. Let's start up. Let's start up with the structure of could you. Just for you to remember, this is the structure. Could you plus verb in base form plus complement plus question mark, okay? 
And we got the, the example here. Uh, Carla, read the example, please. Could you call me later? Okay, very good. Could you call me later? Let's see the answer. Sure. Si ¿Sí ven? Una palabrita es la respuesta. Something very short and precise, but effective. Sure. And that's it. Seguro. All right. Let's see. Good. Let's continue. Salvador, read the question. Could you complete the activity? All right. Could you complete the activities? Repeat again, Salvador. Could you complete the activity? No, okay. Thank you, Salvador. So take a look at the answer right away. Okay, right away. What is right away, by the way? De inmediato. De inmediato, exactly. Okay, so that is right away. De inmediato. Okay, so we got this, 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 this part, right? So could you complete the activities? Okay, right away. De inmediato. Okay. I don't know if you have any questions related to these things. No sé si hasta, hasta acá tienen alguna pregunta con relación a esta estructura. Something that you don't remember or something that is like hard for you. Because this is the moment to ask. Uh, teacher, uh, Okay, Jonathan. Okay. I'm glad you, you got the, the, the response. Okay, good. Okay, what are we going to do now? Listen up. I want you to create one example sentence. Quiero que me hagan una pequeña. Pregunta usando could you. So let's see if we have understood this part. Okay? Without answer, sin respuesta. Only the question. I will give you one minute for you to finish. Just let me know when you finish. But write down one. One Would example. You send this report? Now, okay, very good, Jonathan. Could you send a report? That is one. Okay, perfect. Share, could you take me home? Ah, okay, very good. Right away. <laughs> <laughs> just just let me get just let me get to San Salvador in five hours and I will get you home. <laughs> <laughs> okay, thank you, Mrs. Janet. Who else finished? Teacher, could you take me to my watch? Ah, okay, good. Could you take me to my work? Okay, sure. That would be an answer. Yes, sir. Yes. Would you help me with the report? Yeah, okay, right away, right? Right away. Very good, Helma. Teacher, um, could you prepare the billings? No, nah, okay. In a moment. <laughs> okay, <laughs> very good, Carla. Who else finished? Teacher. Yes. How do you say calificaciones? Grades. Grades is written. Grades. The pronunciation grades. is grades. Okay, teacher, could you let me know the grades or test? In a minute. <laughs> okay. Right. Seriously. <laughs> okay, very good. Thank you, Eva. Teacher. Yes. Could you take me? Could you take a lunch? Se puede así. Could you take a lunch? Mm -hmm. Yes. 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 Yeah, okay. we can we can put it away. Okay. Could you take a lunch? Ah, okay, right away. I'm hungry. Teacher. <laughs> Could uh -huh. you give me that bottle of water? Yes, here you have. <laughs> okay, very good. Any other one? Um, could you go sleep? 
Okay, right away. Give the class, Romeo. I'm leaving. <laughs> okay, thank you, Romeo. Teacher, uh, could you buy me a coffee? Could you buy me buy a, a coffee? Uh, buy me a coffee? Yes, of course. Here you have a quarter. <laughs> Let's go and buy it. <laughs> okay. Teacher. Okay. Yes? Could you bring me that glass? Yes, of course. <laughs> I will okay. I will I will take you the class. Okay, good. Who else is missing? Ana Garcia, did you finish? Could you pass me the coffee? Could you pass me what? The coffee. The coffee? Uh -huh. Yes, in a moment. Teacher, could you repeat the class, please? <laughs> in, a, in a moment. <laughs> hey, no, yeah, don't put me in that situation. Okay. All right, that, that one was good, no, yeah. That was, one, was, was really good. Okay, William, do you finish? You say, see, we are starting the Uh huh. Teacher. Yes. Could you help me with my homework? Yes, sure. Right uh, away. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> okay, thank you to you. Eric, did you participate already? All right, huh? What were you doing, Eric? So, me levanté solo para ir a tener un, un pequeño accidente. What? Me quemé un poquito la mano, así que mm. ahí tengo pomada ahorita ¿Qué? en la mano. Qué bárbaro. Oh, ¿Y qué bárbaro. Bárbaro. Oh, Dios mío. No, ¿qué, Eric, Eric. Sí. Quiero ver, quiero ver. El café se agarra como un trapito, Eric. Oh. <risa> oh, no, my God. Así, así fue la vez pasada. Teacher, Muy así bien. fue la vez pasada. Me metió la pata por hacer sopepata. Ah. <risa> okay. Enseña, Eric. Ya. Yeah. Oh. Pero ese es. ¿Esa es pomada? ¿Ese es, ¿Ese es algo que tiene algún protector que se le ve como morado? ¿O es tu hand? Una pomada que se llama quemadín, me acabo de aplicar. Sí, lleva violeta de gentiana, creo. Uh -huh. uh, Eric, ese como ay. que es pilot magenta que se ha puesto, Eric, qué bárbaro. Ay, hey, that's true. Solo para no participar, <risa> ¿cierto? Ya, yeah, mi no. Ajá, Eric. We know no, you, Eric. No, We know no. You, Eric. No, no. Ah. que ver. Ok, ok, Eric. Así Eso que... quiero decir que no es buena la cocina. Uh, ah, correcto. No fue no por eso, pero, uh. pero fue un accidente. Ya vi que se le queman los panes. Para, de... mí, para mí que le contestó mal a la esposa, por eso fue. Ah, okay. Y le puso la okay. cacerola caliente en la I'm mano. sorry, Eric. No, pero El... espero se recupere pronto, Eric. Porque uh, sí, eso. Uh, uh, on the hard. face, not, le dije. Entonces. <laughs> not on the face. <laughs> not on the face. <laughs> you can do it in the hand, but not in the face. <laughs> es que, es que dice que es accidente porque está la par. Ah, ah, no, es por mi bien, es por mi bien. <laughs> Yes, man. It's, it's for you. It's for your own welfare. Very good. No, no, es que no me fijé que ella tenía algo caliente ahí. Entonces, eh, cuando yo lo, 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 lo agarré, me cayó el agua encima. Uf. Mm -hmm. Eso. Ya, ya. Yeah. Accidents happen. Sí, es que me voy a desconectar porque ya no puedo estar en clase. Nah. <laughs> sí, yo también me voy a desconectar en solidaridad también. Le va a ir a aplicar pomada. Sí, como no puede. No, no, ya tiene. Ya tiene. Ya tiene. Ah, ok, ok. All right. 
Ok, no problem, Eric. Espero que se, que se mejore ya, porque eso sí arde. Ok, who, who else is finished? ¿Qué más falta? Let me see some of you. Hmm. William, did you, did, did you do yours? Uh, could you uh -huh. could you re revise check it check it check. my uh -huh. my my uh, uh, platform my platform <laughs> my platform the exercise 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 ah okay exercise. in a moment William in a moment, I will check them. Thank you, man. Thank you. Okay, who's missing? Ana Maria has already participated. Jonathan was the first one. Ana Garcia, yeah. Rosa, do you participate already? Come on, people, turn on your cameras. Do you participate already, Rosa? No. Okay, go on, Rosa. You're missing. Could you pass me the book? Yes, of course. In PDF, it goes. <laughs> Could you let me the pencil? Could you let me what? The pencil. The pencil. Yes, it is included. Okay, very good. There you go. Okay, Eddie, you will be the last one. Could you walk to the workplace? Nah. Do I have to walk? Are you serious? Okay, yes, in a moment. Man. In a moment. Yeah, in I need moment. to walk. I need to, for real, I need to walk. Oh my God, I was I was surprised that today, I think it was today. Let me see. Yes. Hoy caminé así como en la parte de Zulután hay una, hay una sección que está como una pequeña subida. Viniendo de San Salvador, Eric. Cuando va entrando a la ciudad, es como una pequeña okay. bajada donde dice bienvenido a Usulután. There is like a down and then you follow up, right? Like an up. Mm -hmm. Oh my God, nice. solo caminé como tres cuadras y ya iba como que, ah, oh, oh, ya no puedo. <laughs> I Qué bárbaro, For real, for sure, I'm not lying. Me estoy mintiendo, en serio. I do really need to do exercise. Yes. Yo he sufrido esta semana por no caminar. Me, hoy no he podido ir a caminar. Yes. Ahí al parquecito, ahí en la, en la, en la Grimaldi, ¿cómo es? ¿Cómo es? En la calle uh -huh. Grimaldi, Eva. Yes, ahí al yes. parquecito debería ir a caminar. Yeah, I mean, I, I, go, I usually go with my wife there to get a minuta and talk in there in front of the church. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's pretty cool. It's pretty cool. Hey, but de que lo diga, que lo haga en un gran espacio ok, let's continue so this, this was like the uses of could you, now let's jump into would you mind which is uh, kind of different, ok different in a structure but not in meaning right, the structure ah, Hilma, read the structure please Structure and would you mind flat bird in ing flat uh -huh. complement last question mark okay good read the question Hilmar would you mind opening the door please now okay thank you would you mind opening the door please si ven acá ya la estructura Sí, ya cambia un poco, ¿ok? Ya no es cool, es will. Es la estructura, ¿ok? La estructura siempre va a llevar will you mind. ¿Qué decíamos que era? What is it? Will you mind? Te importaría. Ah, ok, very good. ¿Ok? Will you mind? Eh, and remember, after mind, el verbo que pongamos que indique acción, the verb that indicates action, it has to go in ing. If you got it, it must be eating. If you have dance, it has to be dancing. If you have work, it has to go working. Okay. If you had the verb go, it has to be going. Okay. 
all of the verbs that you put in there, you got to put it in ing. Okay, in ing. Remember that. So, would you mind opening the door, please? And we got the exact answer as the one before. Yes, of course. All right, that's part of the answer. Okay, the second uh, question, example. Uh, let's see, Ana Maria, read it, please. Would you like, would you mean sending a text message? All right, let's repeat again, Ana Maria. Would you mind sending a sending, text message? Would you mind sending a text message? Okay, message. Message. Okay, thank you, Ana Maria. So, we got the answer right away. Recordemos, acá no podemos poner yes, I would, okay? Because it's not appropriated, okay? Grammatically is correct, pero es lo que decíamos anteriormente. Es como que demos una respuesta positiva, pero con la posibilidad de que no hagamos lo que se nos solicita, okay? So that's why we got very short answer, like right away, in a moment, okay? Uh, yes, of course, you all, only yes, all right? As a model of answer, okay? Just that way. Check this out. We got in a minute or right now. Recordemos que right now and right away son sinónimos, okay? It's like in the moment, ahora mismo. Okay. Good. Any question up to now? Una pregunta hasta acá? Teacher. Yes. Uh, not an observation. Mm -hmm. uh, mm -hmm. You what you mind with call you is verb. In it's the a verb using ing with would you mind. Aha. Uh -huh. And for you, use a verb. But in base form. Form. Uh, mm -hmm. La forma normal. Exactly. Es que cuando hablamos de base form, es forma normal del verbo, forma yes. base. Okay. Yes. Si digo forma base es, por ejemplo, si tengo el verbo comer, eat. Eat is the base form. Could you eat the dinner for me? You see? Eat is base form. Ok, ahora bien, ing is like, ya no sería eat, ya sería eating. eating. Could you mind eating the dinner for me, please? That is different, right? Okay, okay porque ya el verbo ya iría con ing. Ok. But, okay. listen up. Pero acuérdense de lo que les mencioné anteriormente. El hecho de que lleve ING no significa que sea presente continuo o una acción en el momento. ¿Ok? Don't get confused. Okay. Si yo le digo, Would you mind opening the door? No le estoy diciendo abriendo la puerta. ¿Ok? Like, ¿Le importaría abrir la puerta, por favor? You see? Simple present. ¿Ok? okay. That's just simple present. Okay, good. Ah, yeah. <laughs> yeah, I, bet I was about to do that. Now, listen. Any question related to this structure? ¿Tenemos alguna otra duda con respecto a esta estructura? No, thank you. Perfect. If you don't have any other doubt, quiero que me hagan lo mismo que anteriormente. I want one example using this structure, okay? Mientras lo hacen, voy a pasar asistencia. Let's do it. Let me stop uh, sharing this information. Give me a second. All right. Ana Claribel? Present. Okay, very good. Ana Maria? Present. Okay, good. Diana Gabriela? Present. Very good, Eric Guillermo. Present teacher. Excellent. Fatima Alejandra. 
present. Good. Ever de Jesús. Present teacher. Very good. Sorry, is not here. Uh -huh. Hilmar Cruz. Present. Excellent. Uh, Jonathan Alexander. Present teacher. Very good. Carla Benazir. Present teacher. Okay, perfect. Natalie Vanessa. Present. Okay, nice. Nubia Zulema. Present teacher. Very good. Let's see. Romeo Alexis. Present. Okay, nice. Rosa del Carmen. Present. Very good. Let's see. Roxana Yesenia is not here. Salvador Alfonso. Present teacher. Okay, nice. Sara Carolina. Present teacher. Perfect. Uh, Stephanie Lisette. Present. Excellent. William Alberto. William. Okay, thank you, William. Joanny is not here. And the last one is Stephanie Janet. Present. Okay, very good. Thank you. Uh, did you finish the, 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 the example? Yes. All right, people, just give me a second. Uh, I, I, need a, uh, I need water. Okay, give me a second. Como dijo, necesita aguaro, aguardiente o como. <laughs> Algo así dijo. All right, I'm back. Okay, who's gonna be the first one? Envidioso a quemarse la mano fue también para ya no dar clase. Yeah, I got, I got my, my tank in here. I got my food in here. <laughs> okay, Eric. Por, por, por contestar, me va a ser el primero. <laughs> As a way por of botón. punishment. Okay. Nah, okay, yes. let's go. Uh, would you mind paying the bills? Yes, of course. Very good, Eddie. Thank you. Uh, mañana, mañana se los mando. Gracias. <laughs> By email. Okay. Good. <laughs> hey, talking about bills, no he pagado los míos. Oh my god. No, okay. Good. Nubia, read the sec. I mean, read the sec. Read yours. Okay, hey, um, would you mind cooking the lunch, please? Yes, of course. Even though I cannot cook. Yes, yes. Okay. Yes, actually, I need, to, I need to learn to cook. You know, my wife is a chef and I, have, and I don't learn how to cook. I haven't learned how to, how to cook. Oh, my God. But anyway, one day I will learn. Thank you, Nubia. Carla, read your example. Okay, teacher, could you mind placing me that menu, please? Yes, of course. <laughs> In a minute. Okay, Carla, thank you. Hilmar. Uh, would you mind going back to the previous presentation? Yes, of course, in a moment. Good, yeah. Hilmar, thank you. Uh, Sara. Would you mind preparing dinner, please? Uh, preparing the dinner. <laughs> okay, <laughs> right away, Sara. What do you want? <laughs> do you want uh, Maruchans? Okay, good, perfect. I will cook Maruchans for you. <laughs> All right, thank you, Sara. <laughs> Uh, I don't like that one. I mean, it, uh, it's like plastic. Okay. Uh, na, 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 Mrs. Janet. Okay. And um, would you mind taking this document to the bus? No, I wouldn't mind. <laughs> yes. <laughs> no, I'm, I'm giving a positive answer. I'm giving a positive answer, right? 
Okay. Yes. Thank you, Mrs. Okay. Janet. Ever. Okay, teacher. Uh, would you mind stopping share the Hello Pete meme, please? Hello Pete meme. <laughs> okay, right away. Right away. <laughs> Okay, Ever, thank you. William, read your example. Okay. Uh, would, would she mind washing the dishes before the party? Ah, that would be like in third person, but right away, William. Okay, very good. Uh, okay. Romeo. Would you mind? Staying still? Would you mind? Staying. Quedarse. Quedarse. Would you still. mind staying? Uh -huh. Still. Estar, bro. No sé cómo sería. Ajá, no, but staying where? ¿Dónde? ¿Dónde? ¿Permanecer dónde? No, quedarme quieto. Quedarme ah, quieto. no, but that's, that's being quiet. Being ah. quiet. Be quiet. Okay, Romeo. In a moment, Romeo. Like, Patrick. <laughs> okay. Fatima, for yours. Would you mind wiring the email? Yes, I will mind. Nah, nah. Right away, Fatima. Right away. Thank you. Salvador. Let's go, Salvador. Uh, would you mind uh, mind. drinking a beer? Will you mind drinking a beer in a moment, Salvador? Give it to me. <laughs> Voy gunda. ¿Qué? ¿Cómo? Segunda. Voy gunda, como decíamos. <laughs> yeah, one day. Hey, actually, probably next month. Yeah, next month. Yeah, I, I, I will go to San Salvador, probably. 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 Yeah. My wife wants to, to make a, a, a cleaning thing in, in her teeth. So I had to take her to San Salvador. Yeah. Okay. Mm. Yes, of course, man. Yes. <laughs> Ahí está Salvador, que es la, la perdición andando. <risa> Ana María. Mm. Ana, Mar Ana María, tú, ¿verdad? Right? Ok, good. Diana, continue, Diana. Uh, will you mind cleaning the bedroom window? Right away, Diana, right away. <risa> Okay. Lo pensó, lo pensó. <laughs> yeah, cleaning. No. <laughs> okay, Diana. Thank you. Rosa. I just see the forehead of Rosa. I know Rosa is coming. Would you mind learning me a shirt? No, nah, okay. Right away, Rosa. Very good. Thank you. Natalie. Uh, would you mind sending me a picture of you? No, in a moment. Just, just let me, let me be ready. Una captura para me. No, no, no. Oh, come on. No, 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 don't do that. <laughs> hey, I got. I listen. I got very funny faces from you, especially <laughs> Ana Maria. Like. Ve. Así que no esté opinando. Hmm. Solo me estoy riendo. <laughs> I know, Ana María. Ok. Actually, Ana María, uh, participate. Let's read yours. Ok. Would you mind uh, walking in the park? Would you mind walking in the park? Yes, in a moment. Yeah, it's very beneficial. <laughs> Good. Uh, Mrs. Urrutia. 
Nacho is coming very quiet. Hmm. Eh, no sé si está bien, teacher, porque no me fijé en, en el en el, la estructura. Ok, but, but. Es que oigo que todos es el verbo lo dicen con ing, ¿verdad? Yes, it's with ing. Sí. Mm. Could you mind? Um, would you, would you mind? Look. Para decir comprar. Would you mind buying? Buy, ah, buying, ¿verdad? Mm -hmm. could, you, could you mind buying the pizza for the dinner, please? Yes, in a moment. From okay. the little Caesar. Five dollars. Qué mala onda. No, listen, actually, I find it more delicious than the Pizza Hut, and I don't know why. I mean, it's because Pizza Hut is like kind of expensive, and there are some pizzas from Little Caesar that are like, like really cool, really good. Yeah, I mean, when I'm hungry and I don't want to cook, but well. I cannot cook so and when I don't want uh, like, like like to cook I, that's what I do buy pizza that's why we are fat <laughs> that's why I am fat you cannot see my stomach but it's it's, it's kind of big <laughs> <laughs> okay thank you mrs rutia who's missing okay. jonathan did you participate already I'm here. Now, okay. Uh, Let's read yours. No, okay. Yes, of course. In a moment, we'll be ready. Good. Ana Garcia, are you there? Would you mind playing with my brother? <laughs> yes, in a moment. <laughs> yeah, playing with your brother. Hmm, pretty cool. Pretty cool. Okay. Good people. So let's continue with this. Let's continue with the, with what we have in here. That was like using Google Gmail. Now let's use tool. Okay, let's just start with the structure of tool. And should, if you remember, we use it to provide what? What is what are, what are the uses of should? Do you remember what is should? Or when do we use should for? What is should, people? Debería. No. Is used. Okay. It's used for what? To make to, used to make suggestions or give advice. Okay, very good. Thank you, Ever. Yes. It got two meanings. It's just to provide suggestion about something and to provide an advice. Let's suppose I have a headache and I was like, ah, I don't stand my headache and blah, blah, blah. And you tell me, hey, teacher, you should go to the doctor. That is a suggestion, right? Y ahí es una sugerencia que ustedes me hacen, okay? Si yo la tome o no, that's my problem. But you suggest, okay? Pero su deber es sugerir algo, okay? It's like to give an opinion or an advice, as you said, a advice. Good. Let's continue. Give me a second. Example. Uh, Eric, read the example. You should do exercise. Okay, very good. You should do exercise. <laughs> yes, and I, I should do exercise. But eh. let's see who else has not participated that much. Natalie, read. You should be on time to work. Yes, you should be on time for the class. That's another extra example, right? An extra example only okay good so you should be okay be 
is the base form of the verb. Recordemos que cuando usamos should, ya que usamos la forma base del verbo. Okay, that's why we got should do or should be. Next example. Let me see who has not participated that much. Diana, help me out, Diana. He show pay attention in class. Nah, okay. Very good. He should pay attention in class. What is something that you got here that is really important to identify? Listen, in this case, it's like really important for you to identify that we don't write the S, E, S, or I, E, S in third person. Acá podemos olvidarnos del uso de la tercera persona. Ah, que si llevo she, que si llevo he, le voy a agregar S al verbo. O E, S, o I, E, S. Now, we do not add those ones even in third person, okay? Just keep that in mind. We are not, like, like, we cannot attach that into a, you know, into a, a, a um, uses of a S or IES in, into this. Good. So let's continue. But before continuing, do you have any questions? Do you guys have any questions related to this? People? Not a job. Nope. Okay. Very good. So let's see. I will give you one minute. Listen up. Just one minute for you to give me an example. Sin necesidad de escribirlo. Quiero que me elaboren un ejemplo in your memory about this. Sobre una sugerencia que me darían a mí as your teacher. Okay? Give me a suggestion to me. To me. Okay? Think about one and, and, and tell me. Cuando la tengan, turn on the microphone and let me know. Just let me know when you finish. Aha, uh -huh. do you have it? You should walk every day. Yeah. Yes, you are right, Ana Maria. I need to walk. I show right. Yes. Teacher. Yes. Teacher, you should give the always extra points. <laughs> to the ones who participate, yes, of course. <laughs> to the ones who do the homework on time, yes, yes, of course. <laughs> yeah. Sure. Thank you, Hilmar. Yes, Stephanie. Um, you show give more practice. Now, nah, okay, very good. Thank you, Miss. Okay. Teacher. Yes. You should learn to cook with your wife. Ok, good. Menos mal tengo earbuds. Si you no, know, ya me estoy diciendo, es cierto, es cierto. Look, your, your students are saying that, 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 that. No. Ok, thank you, Ever. Good Yes. Yes, uh, Ok, first Salvador and then, and then you. Ok, you should go on vacation. <laughs> yes, I need to go on vacation. Thank you, Salvador. Thank you to remind me that I don't have money to go on vacation. Good. Aha, Manubia. Okay, teacher. You show uh, learn about paternity? Yes. Thank you, Nubia. Thank you to remind me that. <laughs> okay. Very good. What else? Who else? Yes. 
Um, you should hit use a break. Uh, read again, Carla. You should hit use a break. Give us a break. Give us. Okay. A break. A break. Great. <laughs> uh, Carla. <laughs> you need a break, Carla. I just see. I just, it's just two hours, Carla. Easy. <laughs> Thank you, Carla. You did it excellent. Somebody else? Issue. Okay, first Ana, uh, Ana Garcia and then you, Diana. Uh -huh, Ana. He okay. should eat healthy. Yes, I need to eat healthy. Thank you, Ana. Okay, Diana. Okay, uh, you should practice yoga, teacher. <laughs> you know what? The last time I I, I, pra I was trying to practice yoga, eh, me, me, me dolió un tendón. <laughs> I couldn't continue. <laughs> For sure, that was, that was in pain. ¿Qué? Eso sí, dolió. Nah, and, the, and and I discovered that yoga was not for me. Yes, Ana Maria. Yes. No le creo. Yes, of course. Yo hice, yo hice yoga un tiempo. En, en ejercicios de estiramiento no puedo, con, 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 con los dedos de las manos no puedo tocar los dedos de mis pies. Siento que mi, mi, mi espalda le va a hacer crunch. Ay. Yes, of course. Teacher. Yes. You should drink more water every day. I got a tank here. Look, a big tank. <laughs> Thank you for the advice, Stephanie. Good. Uh, who else? Who else is missing? Teacher. Yes. You should wash your clothes every day. <laughs> I use it two times. Nah, nah. Yes, yes, Sarah. <laughs> I do it actually. Ah, sure. Actually, not me. The the dish. I mean, the washer. Uh huh. Uh, what the meaning? Shoe. 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 Shoe is like debería. Okay. That is the translation of shoe. All right. Okay. Uh huh. You should go to the gym. Thank you, Fatima. Thank you, Fatima. Thank you for killing me. Okay, uh, Jonathan. Okay, Jonathan and then uh, Eric. Okay. okay. I should, I should practice more English. Ah, okay. Very good, Jonathan. Eric? You should eat pupusas with salsita daily. Yes, man. Yes. Of course. Every day. Yeah. I like the picture I sent you, right? Like eating eating pupusas with, with salsa negra. Yeah, excellent. Okay. Let's continue. Who's missing? Romeo? I should get up early. Oh, okay. You should get up early. Really? You got problems with waking up early, like me? Yes. I need to. I need to have three alarms in the morning. One at four fifteen. The other one at four twenty. The other one at four twenty-five, and the last one at four thirty. Yeah, la última sí o sí. I had to wake up and stand up. Otherwise, I get late to work. <laughs> okay, Romeo. Thank you. Rosa, are you there? Rosa. I got people. You don't turn on your camera. Okay, I think Rosa is not there. William, I'm going to finish with you. Yes. yes. Okay. Give me a suggestion, William. Uh... Using shoes? Uh, you, he, no, you, you should, you should, you should be 
proactive, proactive, proactive in your work. Now, nah, okay, very good, William. Yes. Okay. And Rosa, you were you were turning on your camera, right? Ah, yes, Rosa is there. Okay, Rosa, give me the last example. Yeah. You should finish the homework. <laughs> Okay, thank you, Rosa. Yes, I should finish checking the homework, which is like pretty different. All right, people, we're gonna stay here with the uses of should and then the should not. Let's 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 see only the structure for should not. Check this out. Should not is like the opposite. What is should not? Romeo, read please. is using to have a suggestion, suggestion about uh, something that is not appropriate. Appropriate, ah, good. Thank you, Romeo. Should not is used to give a suggestion about something that is not appropriate, okay? Para dar una sugerencia, okay? About something, sobre algo, that is not appropriate, que no es apropiado, okay? For example, for example, look at this. Mrs. Urrutia, read the first one, please. Uh, the read example, right? Yes. Uh, Darío should not sleep at work. Now, nah, okay, very good. That you should not sleep at work. Ah, this is talking about things in negatives. Ah, y aquí es para dar sugerencias de que no se debe hacer. Okay. Good. Let's read the second example. Uh, Diana. Diana, um, I should not smoke. In my house. Okay, very good. I should not smoke in my house. Should not smoke. Good. Next. William, help me out, please. The last. Yes. She should not fight with her co-worker. Okay, thank you. She should not fight with her co-workers. Right, like no debería pelear con sus compañeros de trabajo. Do you fight with your co-workers, people? No? Nah, Fatima says yes, huh, Fatima? Hmm. Good. Diana, do you fight with your co-workers? Yes or no? Sometimes. <laughs> Sometimes, only when it is necessary, right? <laughs> only when necessary. Hmm. Yes. <laughs> yes, ladies. Like, like el 90% de, 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 las, de las señoras y señoritas que tengo acá si se ven bien enojadas. Very angry. Hmm. Yes. Yes, of course. No, teacher, be happy. <laughs> <laughs> In class, but in work, like, like, ah, why do you do that? Nah, right? Hmm. Miren Fátima, esa carita que tiene, like, bien contenta, pero en, en el trabajo, like, angry. All the time, right, Fátima? Yes, Fátima, say yes. No, oh, no, teacher. <laughs> okay, yeah. Look at Mrs. Janet face. Yeah, ya está regañando al niño. Attendance, please. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> ah, yeah, that's the other one, right? Yeah, that's true. Okay. Ya todo esto ni siquiera escuchó. Okay, listen up. Let's stay here. Okay, let's 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 break up in here, and let's go to the manual. Ahora bien, quiero que saquemos los manuales. We need to cover up some pages. I think we're gonna try to do two pages left. From, from 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 the manual. Give me a second. I'm gonna stop sharing here. 
And I need to change to the manual. And I want you to go to page, if I'm not wrong, it's going to be page 37. Yeah, 37. Most of you got the, 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 the manuals uh, printed. ¿Quién de ustedes tiene los manuales impresos? Like, can you put, podrían poner una manito ahí? I, I need to check. Yo, yo lo tengo impreso. Ok, very good, Jonathan. Uh, Rosa. We got uh, Novia. Mm -hmm. Salvador, I guess. Sara. Ok, cool. We're going to use it. We're going to use it in here. Uh, in this part. Check this out. The one that we got here. We got a puzzle here. Check this out. What are we going to do here? Listen up. In here, we got a puzzle, all right? A puzzle or, or, or a, a letter soup, okay? And in here, we got the possible words that we can find in there like etiquette, guidelines, polite, manners, regards, punctual, like comer, behavior, salutation, and subject, okay, and subject. What are we gonna do here? We're gonna search for those words in here. For example, if you take a look in here, we got subject, here we got number one, you see? subject it's already here okay so that's pretty much what are we going to do there así es prácticamente como lo vamos a hacer you see just like select all right or or choose the one that you got quien tiene el manual en pdf en pdf ever fatima eric william elmer no okay all right. I don't know if you can modify uh, if you can modify the the the. the. No, right. Sí, lo puedo modificar. Ah, perfect. Let's do it. Yo no lo tengo impreso, teacher. Ah, okay. All right. For you, uh, I just just try to find out. Okay. In este caso, simplemente vámonos a las a la a la a la sopa de letras que tenemos acá and try to. Let's like, on. Ah, what am I doing? And try to just to find the words in there. Simplemente acá tratemos de encontrar las palabras. ¿Dónde las tenemos? Okay, this ones. This ones. The one from here. What is this? Oh my God. Close. More tools and comments. We'll see, request signature, edit PDF. Can I edit the PDF? Really? Oh my God. Ah, give me a second. Que estoy traveseando ahorita. Give me a second. It's 37, if I'm not wrong. Yeah, 37. Thank you. You're welcome. 37. Okay, we got number one in here. Look, we got the word. Oh my God, what is it? We got the word subject here. Okay, here is one. Then we got the word etiquette. Search for it. Let's look for it. Etiquette. Where is it? I. <laughs> Where? I am in the, in the third column, on the right. Uh-huh. Where? I don't find it. <laughs> Aquí, ahí. La Por fila abajo. Ahí. La segunda es... fila de las últimas personas. Oh my God, I don't find it. Are you sure? 
Okay. Give me a second. Lula. <laughs> Let me see. Lula, que no se ve la E. La V, la última V. Ahí This está. One? Ajá, pero comienza la P para atrás. This one? Yes. Really? Etiquet. Luba teacher. Okay, give me a second. Uh -huh. There you go. From here, right to here, here, up here. There you go. We found it. Thank you, people. Let's see. Guidelines. This is the next one. Guidelines. Do you got it? La última columna de abajo para arriba. Arriba de la dalgo. The last column. Oh my God. I'm like kind of dumb with this. Yes. Okay, let me see. Okay, guide me people. From here. Teacher, en la última línea de abajo para arriba. Arriba de la in the last line I'm grown to, to, to the one in la última columna from last column all right da, 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 ah guideline guideline okay very good you got it in here Guideline. Yes. Polite. What is it? Polite. Finish the. Es una columna abajo a la parte de la B al revés. Polite. Polite. Ah, uh -huh, very good. You got it here, right? Polite. Excellent. Yes. Okay. Manners. What is manners here? What? Six color. Ah, very good. I there you go. Money. Should we annotate here? I guess I guess I can draw it. Yes, of course. Behavior. Next. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, behavior. What is behavior? Next. Next to that column. In this column? Yes. In the same one? Uh, the seven column. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. <laughs> Where? Uh, up. Okay, I'm a, I'm a go up. Permítame, voy a subir. Mm -hmm. Okay. Behavior. Very good. All right. Who's next? What is the next one? Late comer. Uh, Nice column. Now, okay. Late comer. Hmm, 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 hmm. Draw. Where is it? Nine column. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. I. Okay, in here, right? There. No, okay. Next column, uh, etiquette. Etiquette? Yes. Mm 
Yeah, okay, you got it here. Next column, salutation. Salutation. Yeah. From that. here, right? Salutation. Okay. Last column. Uh, next column, uh, guideline. Okay, very good. Guidelines. This is the one in here, right? The one that you chose. Very and good, the, people. And the second column. Uh huh. Punctual. I think you got it one before, right? Wow. Yes. The yeah. next column, rigor. Okay, very good. And the uh, and how do you say either? Fifth? Fila. Row? Mm hmm The fifth row? Um, and the last? Uh-huh. Polite. Polite, 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 polite. And the ultima. This one? Mahawa. Uh, a little bit down. Okay, give me a second. Ah, yeah, right. You got polite here. Polite. Now, okay. Very good. Now, people, what are we gonna do? This is just for you. How how to find how to find those those words? Now, let's go back here. We have all drawings. And let's go on to, to the next part. The one that really matters to me. Listen up. We're going to do this part all together. Right? Let's do it all together. Listen. It says, identify and correct three mistakes in the request below. What does it mean? En estas cinco oraciones hay tres que tienen tres errores. Okay? What is our obligation? Encontremos esos errores. Find the mistakes and correct them. Example number one. Would you mind moving your car? It's blocking mine. Is that correct or incorrect? Correct. 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 Very good. Number two. Uh, Hilma, read it, please. You call Phil the purchase. Order. Is that correct or incorrect, Hilmar? Mm, incorrect. Yes. Why? Porque tiene que decir cool you, y ahí dice you cool. Exactly. Aquí ya no tenemos la estructura de una pregunta, sino de una oración. All right. En ese caso, tenemos que switch it, cambiarla. Okay. Just switch it. In this case, is cool you okay cool you hey i'm apply this part give me a second edit 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 pdf okay entonces acá you cool feel sería Cool you, right? Like this. Like this. Could you feel this purchase order? That would be the one. Very good. Ah, uh, let's see. Sarah, read number number three.
could you please with more young paper, please, please? Sara, is this one? This one. Would you send in? Would you send in this invitation to your assist assistant? Okay, is that correct or incorrect, Sara? Yes, correct or incorrect? Correct. Correct. What do what the, do the rest think? ¿Qué piensan los demás? Is that incorrect. correct? Incorrect. 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 Ah, incorrect. What is that? Would that? you mind? Would you mind, Francis? Ah, okay. Would you mind? So mind is missing. Very good. What do we need here? Look. Would you mind? That is missing. Okay. So mind is missing. Very good. Now, would you mind, you see, would you mind sending this invitation to your assistant? That's the way. Very good. Uh, Fatima, train number four. Would you mind ordering something to it? Is that correct or incorrect, Fatima? It's correct. Yes, but good. William, green number five. <clears throat> um, could you come in earlier tomorrow? We need to receive our okay. visitor. Okay, receive our visitors. All right, William. Is that correct or incorrect? Uh, incorrect. Okay, what is the correct one? The, the answer. Uh -huh. ¿Cómo sería entonces? Can you read it? Of course. Where? Uh, could you, uh, could you, this, 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 this part is okay. Could you? The verb is in form. Ajá, ajá. Eh, ¿Cómo dicen que ir el verbo? Con. Ah, very good. Come. Could you come earlier tomorrow? We need to receive our visitor, right? So it has to go come like this. Right? Um, like this. Yes, could you come earlier tomorrow? We need to receive our visitors. Thank you, William. That's, that's correct. That's the one. Okay, uh, let's keep going with the other one. Let's get down. Now, in here, people, it says, Select the most appropriate answer for the request below. Example, tenemos el número uno, dice, mm, Nubia, read for me, please. Would you mind turning the light, the light on? Okay, we got A. Read A. No problem. And B? Yes, I will. Okay, what do you have to do? De esas dos posibles respuestas tenemos que escoger una. ¿Cuál es la más apropiada para contestar la pregunta? No problem. No problem. Very good. Bien, hagamos las demás. Let's do the other ones. Remember, we are only answering or we are only going to answer the most appropriate one. Vamos a escoger la más apropiada ahí, la respuesta más apropiada. But the one that you think is correct. Who sent the picture to the group? 
Ah, uh, very good. Ah, uh, good edit. Alfonso. Ah, uh, ah, uh, you got it there. Nada que ver a mis muñequitos. But anyways, mines are better. Are way better. There you go, people. Let me know when you finish. I finished. Very good. So you finish. Perfect. Let's start. Eric, can you please read number two and uh, mention the most appropriate answer? Okay. Could you order something to eat, please? Uh huh. It's pizza, okay? Is pizza okay? Very good. That's the most appropriate one. Esa es la respuesta más apropiada. Very good. Uh, let's see. Natalie, read number three. Could you repeat more jumbo paper clips, clips, please? Okay. All right. Could you request okay. more jumbo paper clips, please? Okay, very good. What is the most appropriate answer, uh, Natalie? Right away. Are you sure? Natalie? Hola. Are you sure? Segura que es esto? Mm. Sí, yo creo que sí. <laughs> <laughs> Natalie, you have to be sure. Yes, yes, it is. Right. Con seguridad, que esté 100% equivocada. <laughs> no, <security>. let's <laughs> see. No, Natalie, you're okay. Yeah, you are correct. That's the correct one. Okay. Okay. Very good. Uh, let's see who's next. William, help me out with number four, please. Um. Would you mind mm -hmm. get 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 it? Getting uh -huh. ten, ten copies uh -huh. of the report of this report. Okay, very good. Which one is the most appropriate? A or B? Um, the B in a minute. In a minute. Very good, William. In yes. In a minute. Very good. That's an expression to show something positive. Good. Ana Garcia, read number five. Excuse me, could you do though the volume? 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 Volume. Volume a bit. Uh-huh. Uh, no problem. Not a problem. Okay, very good. ¿Por qué no podemos yes I could? Ah, porque es como cuando decimos sí podría. Ah, pero significa que probablemente no lo vamos a hacer, ¿cierto? That's, the, that's why we don't answer with yes I could. Very good. Let's keep going. Okay. This is part of what we got. Hmm. Now, listen. Listen, what are we going to do with this information? Listen up. Instead of doing it here, en vez de hacerlo acá, porque, ¿qué vamos a hacer acá? Listen, listen, listen. What are we going to do here? Dice, write a suggestion about the following behaviors. In, y dice, Sara never stops chatting on the phone when we have lunch. Okay, in here, what are we going to do is just to write down sentences using should. Okay, aquí como está pidiendo que escribamos sugerencias, aquí vamos a utilizar should. ¿Qué vamos a hacer? Leer la oración y de esa oración vamos a sugerir algo. We're going to suggest something. Example, vamos a hacer la número uno. Pay attention to this. Dice, Sara never stops chatting on the phone when we have lunch. 
¿Cómo sería acá la sugerencia? Ok. Si yo fuera un compañero de ella, yo diría. She should not use o she should not chat on the phone when having lunch. Oh, like this. Oh, like this. And lunch, like this. Uh, you see? This is a suggestion. Bien, acá ya tengo una sugerencia para esto. You see? She should not chat on the phone in lunch. Aquí, ¿qué estoy haciendo ya? Estoy usando el should not para hacer una manera apropiada de decir que algo no está del todo correcto. ¿Ok? And we need to change something. Good. ¿Entendimos lo que vamos a hacer? ¿Do we understand? People, ¿did we understand? Yes, teacher. Yes, ok, good. Listen, what are we going to do with this information? Ok. Por motivos de tiempo y para respetar su horario, listen, lo que voy a hacer es que en la sección de discussion, en la sección de discusión, voy a postear, listen up, voy a subir estas cuatro, let me see, one, two, three, four, ya, yeah, estas cuatro, give me a second, what happened? Voy a subir estas cuatro oraciones, this one, ok? Esta, las voy a subir a la sección discusión de la plataforma y quiero que ustedes me escriban una suggestion, una sugerencia por cada una de ellas, ya sea usando should o should not, dependiendo del contexto. ¿Estamos? ¿Do we understand? Yes. ¿Alguien no ha terminado a, compre a comprender del todo qué vamos a hacer? Let me know. No, ok. I guess everybody understood. Perfecto. Entonces todos comprendimos qué vamos a hacer. Voy a subirla en la sección de la plataforma, en la sección de discusión. Y van a tener, pues, like today, I mean, tonight and tomorrow to finish. Va a tener hoy y mañana para poder llenar esa sección de comentarios. Ok. There you go. Uh, people, uh, para los que todavía me deben, listen up, antes de irnos, <ríe> me parezco desarrollado, pero it's necessary, it's important. Para los que me deben tarea, please, los voy a estar esperando hasta ¿qué? once y media, máximo, ok? From tonight, please, let's finish. Ana García, ah, creo que a usted le falta todavía parte de las tareas, ¿cierto? Teacher. Yes, I, gonna... finish, I finish the homework, the platform. From 11 to 15? Uh, I finish. Uh, no, it's uh, la, la, la tarea de la plataforma. Aha, de la 11 a la 15? Sí. Perfect, Jonathan. Thank you. Right. I appreciate it. Ana Garcia, are you there? Yes, teacher. Me faltan uh, three. Okay, perfect, Ana. Eh, ahí sí, Ana, la, la voy a querer para esta noche, ¿ok? Ok. Please. Ok, thank you. Con Gilmar, ya estamos igual, Gilmar. Eh, I, I will be waiting for you. And that's pretty much. Creo que sí. Just, just, just that, ¿ok? Ahí sí, se me ha quedado alguien. I'm gonna type in the group. Ok. Eh, all right, people. Entonces, con esta clase, damos por finalizada la semana 3. Mañana iniciaríamos semana 4, ok, week 4, and we will be finishing this module by the next Thursday, ok, by the next Thursday. So, ¿qué es lo único que les queda entonces? Si no me han completado la tarea 15, please do it, y si ya la completaron, simplemente complementenme lo que voy a subir ahora en la sección de discusión, ok, de la plataforma, utilizando should and should not de la tarea que vamos a hacer ahorita, pero no lo dejo como tarea para traer mañana, 
para que no nos vayamos a atrasar mucho. Y así de una en la sección de discusión la podamos hacer. ¿Ok? Perfect. Ah, como ahora no vino Ro bueno, no, no se presentó Roxana eh, Salvador. Uh, uh, we're going to stay with the 10 minutes break. Break. Feedback. Okay? okay. I'm thinking I'm thinking of break. Quien me mencionó el break, ella me dejó viciado. I want break. Now, uh, I'm going to pass the attendance list and we'll finish the class. Just give me a second. All right, let's, let's pass the attendance list. Ana Claribel. Present. Okay, thank you. Ana María. Present. Very good. Diana Gabriela. Present. All right. Eric Guillermo. Present, teacher. There you go. Ever de Jesús. Ever. Present, teacher. Ah, okay. Very good. Fátima Alejandra. Present, teacher. Okay, very good. Oridalia is not here. Gilmar Cruz. Present. Very good. Jonathan Alexander. Present, teacher. Very good. Uh, Carla Benacer. Carla Benacer. Ay, where is Carla? All right. She left, I think. Uh, let's keep going. Nubia Sulema. Present, teacher. All right. Thank you. Romeo Alexis. Present, teacher. Okay, good. Natalie Vanessa. Present. Okay, perfect. Let's see. Roxana del Carmen. I mean, Rosa del Carmen. Roxana del Carmen. I'm changing your name, Rosa. Present. <laughs> okay, I'm sorry, Rosa. Yeah, Rosana is not here. Salvador Alfonso. Okay, very good. Sara Carolina. Very good. Stephanie Lisset. Present. Ah, you were not there, right? No estaba ahí. William Alberto. No, no, pero es que no podía quitarle el mute. Good. William. Present. Ah, thank you, William. Okay, uh, Joanny Noemi. No here. And the last one, Stephanie Janet. Present. Okay, perfect, people. So that's it for, for, for this class, for this video conference then. Uh, see you tomorrow in another video conference starting week four, people. Bye bye. Have a wonderful bye -bye. night. Bye bye. Bye bye. Take Good care. night. Good night, everybody. Good night, teacher. Bye bye. Hey, Salvador, stay. <laughs> Don't go. <laughs> no se me vaya a ir. No, ya Salvador. Bye, teacher. Bye, Buena paja, tiene. Porque está bien. Usted también. Ya, ya lo van a corromper, teacher. Ahí. Yes, Nos vemos. Yes. Good night. Bye, bye, Eric. Al menos no nos quemamos, pues. Ajá, ey. Se fue antes de que le dijera. <laughs> ok, Salvador. We're going to have 10 minutes for you to bring up any doubt that you might have with the homework, with the topics. Ok. Vamos a tener 10 minutos. Salvador, are you there? Sí, sí, sí. Ah, es que aparece la imagen toda frisada. Eh, vamos a tener 10 minutos en los cuales eh, vamos a, a, a retroalimentar cualquier tema o cualquier parte de, de, de tema que, que no esté del todo claro para usted, ya sea de esta clase o de las clases anteriores. Ok, so. gracias, teacher. Eh, sí, solamente se recuerda unos días que me ausenté. Bueno, sí estaba conectado, pero me ausenté. Uh -huh. eh, sí, ahí sí les conozco que que vieron mi seguimiento. Ajá, ajá. And uh, do you remember those days, Salvador? Fue, si no me equivoco, creo que fue el jueves pasado, jueves y viernes, 19-20. 
All right, let's see what was the topic from that day. Give me a second. Last short thing. Hmm. We were starting actually at unit number three. Give me a second, Salvador. And I'm gonna cut this. Sería la clase 11. El jueves iniciamos con la clase 11. All right, because on Friday fue la clase 12, lunes 13, uh, martes no tuvimos, miércoles 14 y hasta la 15. Uh, Salvador, uh, we, were, we were doing the, the, the structure that we were practicing today. Básicamente estuvimos hablando sobre la estructura que ahora estuve dando retroalimentación, que en este caso es Could you and would you mind? Esas fueron las estructuras que estuvimos practicando. All right, and we were working. Uh, let me check. Let me see. Would you mind? Y el otro era, ¿no? Could you? Estas, mire, Salvador. This one. Would you mind? Uh -huh. yes. This one. Yeah. So, I would. Could you and would you? Ajá, aquí sería la estructura para crear ese tipo de preguntas. Decíamos que could you and would you mind era para Do you remember the, the, the uses of this? Sí. No, okay. It was like for a very polite request. For teacher, polite teacher. request. Ajá. Eh, pero una pregunta, ¿por qué es la diferencia? Esta misma, esta misma estructura se preocupa en esas dos frases. Ajá. Pero la diferencia de could y would All right, cool and cool. Cool es un poco más formal que cool. All right, esa es una de las diferencias. La otra, could you es like como podrías. Okay, example, look, look at this. Could you call me later? Podría llamarme más tarde. Could you call me later? Y el modo de respuesta, sure, seguro. Okay, sure. All right. En cambio, would you mind es como, ¿qué importaría? llamarme más tarde solo que ya call ya no iría sería calling con ing would you mind calling me later ¿te importaría llamarme más tarde? y la respuesta sería la misma o sea que el de would es con, con ing exacto cuando usamos would el verbo tiene que ir en ing yes okay. y el could con ba forma base Could you complete the activities right away? Como en, en el momento, right? Ahorita mismo. Ahora bien, a esta es la, la otra. Mire, would you. All right, léame el ejemplo, por favor. Would you mind uh, opening the door, please? Okay, very good. Si ven yes, la respuesta, course. yes, of course. Sí, por supuesto. All right, look at this. Would you mind Would sending you a text message? Ajá. Ahí ya tenemos igual el verbo send en, con ing. Sending. Sending. Exactly. Okay, and look at the answer. Right, right away. Yeah, right away or? Away. In a minute. In a minute or? Right now. Right now. Entonces, básicamente, la estructura cambia. Con would you mind, vamos a escribir el verbo con ing. Y con could you, el verbo va en modo base. ¿Ok? Va en modo base. ¿Y el de hold you mind? Ah, va con ing. También con ing. Would, would you mind? Eso es, eso es lo que tenemos acá. Look. Eso es lo que dice acá, en esta parte. Miren. Acá, el verbo... Cuando usamos would you mind, va con ing. Would you mind opening, you see? Uh -huh. ¿Y, el anterior, teacher, y, el, ¿Y el anterior? ¿Este right. era would, would o cool? No, era cool. Era este ya. Yeah. Permítame. Let's, let's move back. Let's move back. back, back. There you go. It's cool. Cool. Yes. 
Could you call me later? ¿Podrías llamarme más tarde? Could you complete the activities? ¿Podrías completar las actividades? You see? Uh -huh. That's the way how it works. Ese sería el formal, ¿verdad? Exactly. That's right. ¿Y el, de, el que es H-O-L-D? Cool. ING. Ese es aún más formal que este. Igual, o sea, pregunta formal, respuesta formal, ¿verdad? Exactly, exactly. Mm -hmm. Yes. Yes. Este de could you es con verbo en forma base. Would you mind? Ya ese sí es con ing. Ok. Esto puede ser también, eh, siempre tiene que utilizar las el primera persona o la tercera. ¿verdad? Yes, aunque se este puede tipo utilizar. De, sí se pueden, aunque este tipo de preguntas es más que todo utilizado en primera persona. ¿Por qué? Porque son preguntas instan, instantáneas en las cuales usted tiene que proveer una respuesta. Ok, ahora bien, si hablo en tercera persona, gramaticalmente es correcto, solo que no, es poco común. ¿Por qué? Le explico. Supongamos que yo quiero que Eric me haga un favor. Por ejemplo, yo digo... Salvador, could he call me later? ¿Podría él llamarme más tarde? ¿O podría Eric llamarme más tarde? Entonces, ¿quién está en la obligación de responderme ahí? Usted tiene la obligación de responderme, aunque usted no sepa cuál es la respuesta de Eric. ¿Y sí? Porque Eric es el que va a hacer la actividad, o sea, la acción que estoy solicitando yo. Entonces, por eso es que poco se usa la tercera persona. Es más que todo, primera persona, directamente. ¿Ok? A usted. Y no involucrar a una tercera persona. Porque nosotros se nos haría feo hablar o responder por otra persona. I don't know if you understand my point, Salvador. No sé si eh, comprende mi punto. Sí, sí. No, ok, very good. Eh, pero este solamente, por ejemplo, no lo puedo referir por mí, ¿verdad? O sea, my. Solamente could I, you. Uh, could I? Yeah, it would be mostly you. Porque eh, eh, digamos que sí se puede, solo que no tendría tanta lógica decir, ¿podría abrir la puerta? ¿Podría yo abrir la puerta? Ok, entonces usted mismo se tendría que dar una respuesta. Right? So, Mi but, mismo but, se puedo. Ajá, uh -huh, exacto. Entonces, <risa> gramaticalmente es correcto, solo que en este caso, pues, es más que todo con el you, tú sabes. Directamente una segunda o, o, o un plural. Pero se puede encontrar así frases, entonces, como, yes. como el que tercero. Yes. Por ejemplo, con lo que se me está diciendo, se puede encontrar como un escritor, un pensamiento interno cosas así, se me ocurre exactly, exactly, exactamente right. so, okay. it is possible yes. entonces sí, sí ya, ya le capté pensé que me había perdido más Perfect. pero, lo, pero lo, refuerzo, lo refuerzo sí yes. y Esto básicamente, sí. Ajá. básicamente eh, todo lo que estuvimos viendo en la semana pasada, en el jueves pasado lo hemos estado viendo ahorita en toda la clase el uso de would you mind, could you y should, y should not. Fueron los temas centrales, por así decirlo. Ok. Yes. I don't know if you have any other questions, Salvador. No sé si tiene alguna otra pregunta. No. no. No, no, no. ¿No? ¿No más questions? No, okay. gracias. Ok, Salvador. ¿Cómo vamos en la plataforma? ¿Está bien? Okay? Eh, ya hice la de hoy. Perfecto. Perfecto, entonces, solo quedaría la última que voy a subir ahora, bueno, más tarde, eh, pero en la sección de discusión, ¿ok? En la okay. cual usted me tiene que elaborar una oración a partir de cada, de cada oración que tenga ahí, utilizando should o should not. Ok, perfecto. All right, perfect, Salvador. So, if there is, a, if there is no any other questions, let's see you tomorrow, Salvador, ¿ok? Ok, teacher, bye. Bye, bye, Salvador. Good night. Good night, good night. Okay, bye.